Okay, now we are at 239 Berwick. This is actually in the same neighborhood, Myers Mill, as the one on Longford, but it's just an, an older side of the neighborhood, just a few years older. So you can see it just has a totally different look and feel. The houses are not on top of each other. Um, so this one is listed for 240. It does say that it's got a 30 year roof on it. That's nice. Architectural shingles. Um, it does say in the notes that the seller will provide a carpet allowance and that they're extremely motivated. So you've got a really pretty front porch. And although the carpet does not look bad, it smells really bad in this house. Um, the scent is overwhelming of dog. I mean, truly overwhelming. Anyway, I'm just walking you through. This is a formal living room. This is a formal dining room with really pretty hardwoods. I think maybe once you got rid of like their furniture, you can see animals lived here and the carpet. That would help um, for sure. New carpet would solve the scent issue. Pretty hardwoods in the foyer and then of course you've got a really beautiful entryway. Nice coat closet. This is going to be your powder room here. So just your typical, I can't find the light, just your typical powder room with a little pedestal on one end, toilet on the other end. Oops, sorry, finger in the way. <laughs> okay, and then you walk into your dining, eat-in dining area, really pretty kitchen, tile floors. So all of these hard surfaces are not gonna hold that scent, um, but obviously the soft ones are. Um, let me just, I need to pull one of my cards out and leave it on the counter for the seller, sorry. Um, so yeah, pretty countertops. I'm not sure if these are quartz or sile stone, but either way, it's a nice kitchen. It's not quite as nice as the one on Longford. Um, I think you probably would do some painting in here, especially along this back wall, but the other walls are a really pretty gray. Again, carpet does not look bad, but it definitely... And then you've just got a two-car garage out there. I hope you can see that. I'm worried that there's a dog that I'm not aware of. Um, it does have a hardwired security system. You've got a nice little um, storage closet there. This is a wonderful space. This kitchen into the living room. You would like that a lot. And then I think you would really like the yard, too. You've got a screen porch. You've got a pretty patio. And it goes pretty far back there. I don't know if you can see, but the yard kind of slopes a little bit. So it actually goes back further than what it looks like. And you've got like a crepe myrtle there and you know, that's cute. Good, good yard. There's a pantry here, I think. Yeah, pantry. All right, let's go upstairs. So I know this one is already a little out of your price range and on top of it, you would just die with the scent. So, I mean, I would definitely want them to fix that, replace the carpets. Um, let's go over here. There's a bedroom here, which is a good size. So there's no loft in this house. So maybe you would use this as like your Second living space, loft area. Master is here, it's huge. That's not huge, it's a good size though. Pretty bathroom, double vanities, shower, tub, walk-in closet. It's a decent size. Oh yeah, it goes back there quite a bit. A lot going on with this house.
laundry tile floors that's a good laundry space women in the hallway wow you have a huge room here gosh maybe you'd use this as the media space i mean it is big just your normal size closet here but this this space is really good big big room and then hall bathroom tile floors again and then the fourth bedroom which is a good size as well it's not as big as the one over there across the hall it's got a giant closet so i'll stand over in this corner so you can try to get a feel for how big it is good size so yeah the problem with this is on top of it being you know fifteen thousand more than you want to spend you definitely would want them to take that carpet up prior to closing um not to say that it couldn't happen because the house is nice and they do seem motivated i think they're going to have a hard time getting it sold because the scent is overwhelming when you walk in but it does have a lot of nice features you've got the thick crown molding you've got the screen porch so yeah some positives and some negatives